For this counter, each time the CU input, I1.0, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter will count up. When the CD input, I1.1, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter will count down as long as the output is greater than 0. The counter cannot count down if the output is 0, and the counter does not count negative. When the S input, I1.2, transitions from 0 to 1, the preset value, in this example 50, will be placed at the output. The preset value must be formatted with a C pound before a number, and the numeric range is between 1 and 999. The counter will then count up or down from the preset value. If the R input, I1.3, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter will be reset. The CV output outputs an integer value, and the CV underscore BCD output outputs a BCD value. Let's monitor the block. Make sure network 1 is highlighted. As the CU input, in this case I1.0, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter counts up. When the CD input, I1.1, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter counts down. When the S input, I1.2, transitions from 0 to 1, the preset value 50 is transferred to the output. The counter then counts up or down from that preset value. When the R input, I1.3, transitions from 0 to 1, the counter is reset. And that concludes this video.